Ladies and gentlemen, um, I want to introduce you to my friend Brittany Bybee. She's a senior at um, Hananiga. Yep. Maybe you've heard of it. She <laughs> plays um, that sport where you run around and kick the ball. Soccer. Soccer. Maybe you've heard of it. Um, all good stuff. She's a senior, so she's, she's been doing this for a while. Okay. So the, Brittany and I had an interesting conversation about athletic performance because she's looking to go out this year bang. with a bang. Yeah. Have a big time season. Last year we got a concussion. Yeah. Do you, I? We don't recommend that. Um, no. Neither do I. <laughs> not a positive experience. Nope. Head ringing. Blah 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 blah. Bad experience. But we we were talking about how too often kids get hurt within. We'll talk soccer specifically because that's yeah. what you know. What, what do you know about kids getting hurt in soccer? Um, especially with like girl sports, like female athletes, a lot of like lower body injuries, especially um, from like lack of strength training. They focus like too much on their sport and like the technical side of it, but they don't focus on the like athlete side. And that's easy to do. Yeah. So these kids are playing soccer? Like six days a week. Awesome. A lot. A lot of soccer. Fantastic. And not much anything else. All right. So they use the same body parts and the same like motions day in and day out. And over time, your body kind of just breaks down. And you're more like vulnerable to injuries. So. Gotcha. What do you What do you think would um? Or you've gotten stronger, better, oh, yeah. better. What 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 have you noticed within your soccer game? Um, I'm definitely a lot like faster in the field, a lot stronger, a lot more stable. I feel like I'm not gonna just like fall in a weird like in a weird angle and just my leg's not gonna snap or something. Maybe a so, silly question. Oh, sorry. Safer. I feel like I guess safer. Maybe that's the best word. That's I a good word. Yeah. How, how does that affect your performance on the field? Um, I guess I'm just like not as like hesitant. Like I go out there and play 100 mm -hmm. all the time. And Things dropping. <laughs> yeah. And um, I guess I'm just like just stronger. I don't know. Like mentally and physically mm -hmm. stronger. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. I think it's a tough line to walk. Yeah. Between like you need the sports skill because if you if you physically can't kick the ball. You're bad. Yeah. You can be the best athlete in the world, but if you can't kick the ball, you stink. Right. But you could have all the soccer skill in the world and be slow and unathletic and uh, and be bad. Right. <laughs> so you you kind of need that combination of and you know what's the right balance. Mm -hmm. and I think you've done pretty it's well so far. Different for every athlete. Too. And I think it's different for every athlete too. <laughs> That's huge. Yep. We're ending on that note. <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs>